Kids with autism are getting a helping hand from one New Mexico fisherman. He's not an artist, but he's taking to designing lures to raise money for kids who need pricey therapy. News 13's Jamie Seymour is here to show us what he's been working on. Good morning, Jamie. Crystal, good morning. Matt Pelletier makes realistic fish eyes for lures. He found some of the cash he's making could help take a load off of parents who pay tens of thousands of dollars for autism services. I wanted to make a Zia eye for our state, and that's where it all started. Matt Pelletier is in the business of fish eyes. Not real eyeballs, but the art of making realistic eyes for fishing lures. To some people, it does make a difference in whether or not they're going to catch fish or not. It gives them the confidence is really what it does. The colorful eyes take hours to make, but Pelletier's newest design is one of his most passionate projects to date. I just saw something revolving regarding autism. I said, that's it, we make it a cause. Filled with vibrant puzzle pieces of red, blue, yellow, and green, Pelletier is sending them to builders for free, asking in return they paint the special eyes and possibly send the completed lures back to him. I've sent 114 builders' eyes. Um, South Africa, Sweden, Australia, uh, and then all over the states. He hopes to use the artistic lures to fundraise and auction, luring in some money for an important local cause. All the proceeds from the fundraising, the auctions, is going to go straight to our newest ABA therapy, which is a specific therapy designed for children with autism. Abrazos, located in Bernalillo, says they will be the first nonprofit in the state to offer this intensive one-on-one -on -one therapy. Pelletier's project is helping make it happen. Who would have ever thought fish eyes and abrazos would come together to be able to spread both awareness and raise funds? Pelletier's just happy to take his love of fishing and the craft to make a difference in New Mexico. It just feels good to, to do good. Inspiring others to keep an eye out for what good they can do in their communities. There will also be a contest. Pelletier is asking people with a creative design for a lure to send it to him. They will win fishing supplies. The winner will be announced in April, which is Autism Awareness Month. Crystal, back to you. So much, Jamie. What a great partnership. Abrazo says the ABA therapy is desperately needed in the area with 1 in 59 people diagnosed with the disorder in our state.